Okay, so we're going to try and insert the left ear, okay, and this will be a fairly straightforward thing to do. Um, when you actually look at your driver, it's the blue uh, logo that is the left ear, it'll be the red logo for the right, so we've got our blue logo driver here. And this uh, section here, the protruding section, this will actually go into the ear and you can see the two channels for the drivers to uh, project the audio through. So that's what's actually going in. Now this little piece at the top here, this is going to sit in the helix of the ear, um, which is this little, little part in the top here. So that's what I suggest you try and uh, get to seat first without actually pushing this all the way in. So we're going to take the cable, we're going to loop it over around the back of the ear like so. And we're going to take that top section and just seat it in the top. So you can see it's not actually fitted yet, um, but the, this is just this top section of the driver is just seated under the helix. So now that's done, don't just push it in. What you now need to do is very gently start to work it in. And if you pull back on the ear slightly and down on the lobe, you'll find with very little pressure that this will this will seat nicely. And there, I've now got a good seal, and this is nice and flush. So it's going to be different for everyone because everyone's ear shape is different, as I mentioned before. You might find if it doesn't go straight in that um, there might be a little bit of a corkscrew motion needed um, because that tends to be how the shape of the ear canal works. So you might find there's just a little bit of a twisting action to get it in. But once it's in, you should feel it seal. It should be comfortable. And more importantly, all the sound should disappear. It should be nice and isolated before you've even plugged them into your, uh, your audio device. So uh, that's what we're aiming for.